And how did it go with Dabby then? It's a car crash. Oh. oh, you never said. How come? Uh, turns out she's been recording me when I've been sounding off about stuff and putting it online. What stuff? Oh, I don't know. Restaurants that serve you food on bits of slate, feedback forms, dogs and cats. What, and she's been posting that online? Oh, yeah. Got my own page. Kept the crank for rants and bants. Well, there's a, a compliment in there somewhere. Trust me, there's not. I'm a laughing stock. Looks like the drink was just a, another way of getting more material out of me. Dad, that's horrible. Yeah, where's the respect? Well, she must think you're very funny. No. She thinks I'm a middle-aged dinosaur kicking off every five minutes. Oh, thanks a bunch. Come on, how did you leave it with her? I sacked her. She's a good mechanic, isn't she? Yeah, there's plenty of decent mechanics out there without the attitude. He just feels like everyone's laughing at him. Well, they are. In a good way, the guy's a legend. Yes, well, the legend is just seeing the funny side of things. Well, I kind of got that when he sacked me. Well, completely backfired, hasn't it? Only on me. It could be great for business. Kev's page has had loads of hits. There's four people messaging me already saying they want Kev the Crank to do their MOT. <laughs> Get lost. Counts on her. One woman says she's going to book in for a phone for another. <laughs> Have you told him any of this? Hello? I'm sacked. What, so you really think it could be a moneymaker? Well, I, I don't think. I know. If Kev can get past his wounded pride, he could be scowling all the way to the bank. You grab a booze and leave him to me. Liquid lunch, Father. Oh, you've lined your stomach. No lectures. I've had a bad day. Is that because you've lost your wing woman? She's no loss. What can I get you? Can I have half a cider, please, Johnny, and half a lager and lime? Yeah, I'll get sold. Dad, you owe more than half a cider. Do you know eight people have been in contact about the garbage? That's eight potential customers, plus word of mouth. And all you've got to do is be your usual grumpy, glass half empty self. Oi! No, what I'm saying is, you should be thanking her, not sacking her. Abby's got you loads of free publicity, okay? She's figured out that you being a big gnat is your unique selling point. I really need this job, Kev. I was only having a laugh. I only skip people I like. Plus, remember what she did for Mum in prison? Burgle. <laughs> and the time that we got burgled. I mean, Jack could have really been hurt. So, come on. It's ancient history. All right, okay. You can make a start on that blue Civic. You're the best. Well, don't put anything else on the internet without my say-so. Ask me where I'll be this time tomorrow. Hit me. Touching down in Singapore City. It's all right for some, eh? <laughs> my baby's going travelling. Wow, I'm impressed. Oh, Singapore's just for starters. I'm going to meet Imogen out in Southeast Asia. We're just trying to work it out. But then she's going to fly home, and I'm going to fly to Tokyo. What, on your own? Me and Rana always wanted to go to Japan. Dream holiday. She's always with me, you know? Yeah, do you know what? It sounds amazing. You'll do the power of good. Yeah, and wait, the flight's alone. Have you had a secret lottery when you lost? Mm, you could say that. Oh, well, just what a wicked step mother's for. <laughs> and I'm so grateful. You know that. Well, maybe we should leave it up there. It's going to bring in the punches. Well, exactly. It makes great business sense. Yeah, and remember to play to the gallery. No smiling for selfies. What? Well, you think I'm going to pose for flaming selfies? Perfect. Have a rant. Still love you even more. Shall I get the drinks in? Yes. Send me again to them, please. I can have a gin and tonic. Just be yourself. But, but on a bad day. Well done, darling. Well, my dad needed butter and oats, and Abby needed raining in. No biggie. You've taken two hot heads, banged them together, and they haven't even noticed you've done it. <laughs> I'd say that's pretty impressive. You know, you're biased. And you are incapable of taking a compliment. Why do I feel like this is going to turn into one of them pet talks about life, the bigger picture? All right, my lips are sealed, but you and I both know that you have far more to offer this world. Sort Jenny up for me. So it's a promise. Every time you and your big suitcase come, you send me a